back to our channel so today's video is going to be a shopping haul so we've got loads of different type of stuff we've got um food we've got toys we've got kettle we've got basically stuff we need we've got some clothes for christopher this shopping trip christopher got so spoiled obviously he's not here my parents look after him while we went to do shopping because obviously it's busy what's going on i don't really want to take him so we thought why not just film it because we already bought loads of stuff also i do want to say me and livio are going to be having a at home day tonight which i'm pretty excited so we actually mostly went like to buy candles and stuff like flowers and we obviously ended up buying a lot more than we thought but we just thought why not take you around and just show you guys what we basically just bought so don't forget to hit that subscribe button like and comment down below First of all, going to start off with the stuff that isn't food and just show you a little bit of what we got. So, first of all, I want to start off. We got this gorgeous toy for Christopher. It basically sings. It has like it, it's like so. It basically, makes lots of different noises. Um, lots of different buttons. Knees and toes, knees and toes. So I think Christopher will like totally like this as well. So I definitely think Christopher, this is something that Christopher will love. Then we bought what we actually needed. So we needed um, baby wipes, and these were the only ones that they had a pack of. Otherwise, we don't buy Huggies. We buy, um, I think it's a different brand. It's either Little Angels or um, the 99% water ones, I think, if I'm right. So we just bought these because that's the only pack they had. Then we bought a kettle because this we needed like 100%. Our kettle is totally ruined. Um, it has stains on it. It's quite old. It takes so long to boil water. And obviously, as you guys know, we make milk for Christopher. So we need something quick and easy. So definitely I'm happy and money well spent on this. Um, also, I forgot to say, we have a set of this. So we do have the um, toaster as well so that's pretty cool and then livio found these which they are so adorable so they are these cute and gorgeous cups so this one says l and then this one says j and they are just so adorable and just so cute so guys next we have are these two toys that christopher loves so he's got a full set of these now he has um a airplane he has a car so now we bought him an ambulance and a fire truck this is a fire truck isn't it babe yes yeah so we bought him these and they sing um also if you pull them back they go don't they no, i think no. some of I think some of them because I know one that Christopher does, has, one of them does. So I think this is so cute and he's going to love it. And VTech is such an amazing brand and it's such an amazing company. We have our baby swing from VTech. We have quite, we have Christopher's walker from VTech. We have quite a lot of stuff from their company. So guys, next we have these. So if you don't know what this is, this is for Christopher. So this is a potty training. So this is a toilet where he sits and he pees or poops. Um, so it's just a way to learn him. And then this one is the one that goes on top of our toilet. So we weren't sure which one he will want to use. So we just rather bought both and they were both pretty affordable prices and pretty fair as well. So I'm quite happy with that. And maybe you guys are going to say and comment down below that it's far too early. But everyone does it how, how they do it. Um, I know here in London, well, UK, they train their kids three, four years old to potty train. But I just think that's so, so ridiculous because I see now the poops and peeps that, and the amount of nappies we're actually going through is a bit ridiculous. So obviously we want to just start potty training him as soon as possible and he can walk so he will be able to understand. So next we have, we will go on to clothes. So we bought this cute little dinosaur set that Livio loved. 
Um, so it's just short and then these pants, which I think this is adorable. Next, we have one of my favorite pieces. As you guys know, I'm a Disney fan and Christopher's going to be as well. So we have, it's a top like this and then it's got some cute shorts to it. This is a bit size bigger, so this will be perfect for summer. Then we have a set of Paw Patrol. So we were only looking for sets because I don't like to buy like individual stuff. I like for him to have sets. So this one is Paw Patrol. So this is such a nice, colourful, rainbowy um, type. And then it obviously comes with shorts. So all of these outfits are amazing for summer. So one last one. So this is pyjamas. Um, Christopher doesn't really wear separate pyjamas he wears like a full body but as he's getting older he might as well just start to learn um so we bought him it's a top like this and then the bottoms and this is Winnie the Pooh if I'm right Winnie the Pooh and he is absolutely gorgeous this set so you definitely just had to buy so guys we also bought for christopher four of these so if you don't know what they are they're basically bubbles we wanted to buy him the bubble machine but i wasn't happy with the bubble machines they had like there was one that i liked but i wasn't like 100 percent happy with it because i think on amazon i saw better but anyways just some bubbles going to the garden blow some bubbles i think this will be cute and he'll like it then we needed a bath for Christopher to wash him with because um, bedtime bath, we absolutely love this one. We ran out of our other ones, so we had to buy one. Then this candle smells like heaven. Literally, I'm so obsessed with like exotic fruits, tropical fruits, passion fruit, um, pineapple, mango -y smells. I'm just like that type of sweet smell. Livio's more, you're more strong smell, aren't you? Yeah, he's yes. more, yeah, he's more like strong smell. I'm more like sweet flavoured smell. So I absolutely love this one. And this is from the Yankee Candle. So Yankee Candle, as you guys know, is a very expensive brand. So I don't think I have to tell you how much this was. But this is for our date night. And I love it. I love the candle. Then, oh. This is heavy. I, I think I can work out with this. <laughs> I think I can work out with this. Anyways, guys, um, this is the one that we usually use, Lenore. Um, it smells absolutely amazing. It smells absolutely amazing, and it's a mega pack as well. So that means we won't have to like keep on going to the shops every time we do washing and buy because we usually get like the smaller one. And um, yeah, I just think this bigger one is so much better. Then. This is, I think, one of my favourite bits um, that we bought. So this is a pan, and we obviously bought this pan because our other one, Livio, cooked um, something inside, and it basically burnt the pan, and it burnt it like you can't remove it at all, um, because I'm some of the recipes that you cook, you know, they, like, burn um the pants so anyways uh Livio bought this one which we're gonna try this one out and it's a little bit smaller so i think that's actually pretty good that it's a little bit smaller because it's like for pancakes eggs and i just think it's the perfect size um technically so yeah that's all the non-food stuff <laughs> I also forgot to mention I bought this so this is unwind room spray so this it smells actually incredible so it, it has pure essential oils in it so it's supposed to like make you calm and make it like a romantic mood as I'm saying me and Livio are going to be having a date night at home which is insane because obviously all the restaurants are closed so we were like oh why not just have like a romantic date night in so anyways i bought this and then also we forgot to mention we bought this paper but i already actually just quickly used it to wipe down so this is one thing i have been trying to get is this because this i've been loving um it kills colds and flus but unfortunately this one's nearly empty there's nothing in it and i cannot find it anywhere so i'm literally gutted and for delivery it's more than three weeks so let's begin i think with christopher's stuff so this cucumber let's put it in here so 
this is Christopher stuff. So let's begin. So we have some um, food for him. So we have sweet potato, lean beef, hot spot. We have some spaghetti bolognese, and we have spinach and cheese. And I think that one more we have sweet and sour chicken so obviously these foods are just like a backup if we don't cook anything or if we don't have anything that day but we do cook like every single day so i think livio behind the camera he cooks every single day um something so this is just like basically a backup isn't it babe yes babe so it's not before i get any comments by the way any read comments then we love to buy him these so these are smoothies that melt in his mouth um we bought a couple of these because he loves them and we think it's like an amazing treat to give him when he's good and then we've got these fruit wriggles you say them you say that so fruit wriggles and then we've got some apple crisps as well so these actually he never um tried so it's going to be the first time for him to try those then we've got some pear and berry rice cakes and as well some apple rice cakes so for me it's important to always have stocked up on food on snacks on sweets on everything um because obviously he's not going to have this in one day he's going to have like one or two in one day but it's still very important for you never know what's going to happen you know you might run out of money or the shops might close or something like that so it's very important for me to have everything then we can go on to this so this is banana popcorn um he's never had this so this is something new we found as well that i'm excited to give him then these are like a snack for him so these are baby bell i used to love these when i was a child and also these um strings uh cheese strings they're absolutely amazing as well so they're for him then we're gonna move on to these so um this one is that these are like pudding type they're like um those sweet puree type of things that you usually have but we just have it like this and then we mix in some biscuits or we actually can put like our fruit like we cut banana slices and we put it in there and we basically mix it and it's like a dessert let's say so we like to give him this after he eats lunch he has anything so he has either this he has this he has um one of these so we're trying to always after he's had lunch after he's ate everything a couple of minutes later to give him like a snack or like a dessert so he's even more full for longer and then last thing we're actually obsessed with these and he is as well we've been buying these for such a long time now right yes we've been buying these like for such a long time so raspberry and apple soft oak bars they are really good and he loves them so then last thing for christopher as well um is this whole milk fat um 3.7 fat so he drinks this blue milk and i have explained it in our recent vlog he drinks this milk during he drinks this milk during the day and we usually drink the green milk but obviously um we didn't buy any because we're gonna go to shop still because we just had so much stuff we bought and it was everything so heavy so yeah um this is his milk this is what he drinks during the day it saves us tons of money on formula this box of formula that he usually has one week yeah it's second week this one uh, this one is second week and Thanks. usually he was using one this in one week and now he has it for two weeks because he's drinking this milk yeah. daily time and that he has it only for night time so it's really good yeah it's definitely a huge <clears throat> lifesaver to buy this milk all to mums out there don't give your baby this milk until they are over one years old because i seen actually people give this milk to when they were under because they couldn't afford formula i don't care like what you guys do it's obviously your i can't tell you mums like what to do but this is the best milk to give them are when they're after one i've done a couple of research myself so i wouldn't say i'm an expert at it but i would say i know an amazing good knowledge because livio saw me how much i done research about it right so now let's move on to 
all kinds of things. We didn't get that much as I thought because we obviously get loads of fruit and loads of veg from, as I said, Turkish. Livio gets also some different meat and a couple of stuff from a Romanian shop. So it is, um, we don't have just one shop. We shop at everything, right? We shop mm. at different shops. Yeah, it depends. Depends what on what you, you find yeah. where. So, first of all, let's begin. Let's do this quickly. We've got some malt vinegar, which we love vinegar on a salad or something like that. Then sweet peppers. Who does not love sweet peppers? I hate the green ones because the green ones have no taste. A cucumber. Um, these stuff are usually for a salad. Then we bought some spaghetti. So, we have like a lot of... Um, pasta and rice and this type of stuff but we actually for some reason didn't have as much as spaghetti and this is obviously for our date night because Livio is going to be making spaghetti carbonara so I'm excited for that then if you guys know me you know I drink these every single morning they get me up they get my immune system up they make me feel so fresh in the morning this is like a coffee for me you know but it's just like a milk that just boosts you up a little bit in that day so then we have some cottage cheese, which Livio loves. I'm not a huge fan of cottage cheese. We've got some mayo, real mayonnaise, and then obviously some ketchup. Uh, when we have ketchup in the family, it lasts us really long. Mayo is eaten quite quickly because when we obviously have like fried chips or something like that, we all love mayo. Then I bought a Yazoo because this reminded me so much of my childhood and I haven't had it since my childhood. So it just reminded me a lot about that. Bananas. Um, then we've got some smoked mozzarella cheese. Then obviously we got a cream egg because it was in sale. It was in sale, right? Yeah, it was in sale because obviously after Easter they had um, a sale cream Easter egg. And where's the other one? You left it on the table there with the ah, scissors. Okay. Go and bring it. Yeah, yeah. Um, then, oh, then for spaghetti carbonara, Livio got these smoked bacon slices. And I do not know how to pronounce this. Parmigiano. Parmigiano? Parmigiano. Parmigiano. <laughs> Parmigiano. Ok, so, um, some of this... Eh, ma che cazzo stai dicendo? Ma te non sai parlare italiano, devi imparare. Ok, I know, I get what you said. Um, then we got also some pork mints and steak beef mints. Um, so, this is usually cooked, which I usually use it either for cottage pie that I make that they love. Christopher loves it, Livio loves it. Or we're gonna make meatballs out of it. It really depends what we're feeling to eat that day. Then obviously apple and mango juice, just to have some juice. Um, some sausages. And then also, um, as you guys saw, parmigiano cheese, but like the one that you just sprinkle if, you know. So you, he's got two. One option like this, that he can grate and then one just sprinkle. And I think that is it. So last two things, as I said, they had a sale in chocolate. So this one we got, um, Livio got this one for me and then it's got like chocolates like underneath as well. I don't know if you guys can see that. And then obviously this is for dessert for our date night. This is absolutely one of my favorite things. Um, I've been eating this for a couple of years now, forever. <laughs> And I absolutely love it. The chocolate's really delicious. You just put it into the microwave, melt it for a couple of seconds, and then that's it. So, guys, obviously, as it's date night, it wouldn't be complete without buying any flowers. So, obviously, I love roses. They had beautiful roses in there, beautiful red roses. But I said to myself, let's change it up a little bit. So, I bought these roses that cost two pounds a nine, and then I bought these big bouquet mm. of flowers, and I'm just going to like put them and mix them in between to make it just so nice 
Guys, if you do want to see any pictures, make sure you follow me on my Instagram because we post a lot of stories during the day, a lot of pictures about date nights and everything we really do. So make sure you follow and check us out. So guys, I hope you have enjoyed today's video and today's food haul. So this is basically just what we get like for Christopher and for our date night and just a couple of bits and bobs really. It's all random. It's not like our proper weekly shop that we usually do but that's why I wanted to film it because it's a little bit different than what we usually do buy. But I still hope you have enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and we love you all. Thank you to all the new subscribers and we will see you in our next video bye